So as we all know, Xiaomi has a pretty strong line of budget smartphones. The Redmi series are amongst the favorites to the smartphone reviewer when it comes to budget and features. Apart from their very confusing naming convention, which makes it really difficult to tell which one is which, they make hands down the best budget smartphones. And today, I have yet another Xiaomi smartphone with the familiar hard to keep track of name. And this is my experience of the Xiaomi Redmi Note 4X after a month. The Redmi Note 4X takes a lot from its predecessor, the Redmi Note 4, which was a pretty successful phone for Xiaomi. The links are in the description if you want to check out its full review. That phone did initially come out with the Helio X20 chipset, which limits the number of countries it was sold into. On the contrary, the 4X is powered with Snapdragon 625 chipset and probably is one of the cheapest smartphones to be powered by Snapdragon. Resembling its predecessor, the phone is built out of aluminum, adding to its sturdiness. Even the plastic antenna lines now have been replaced with shiny metallic band for a premium feel. The familiar rounded corners make it quite comfortable to hold into one hand. And an interesting thing here is they do offer the phone in a wide range of colors. And I am really digging this blue color which is quite an eye candy. Apart from that, everything else is practically identical. The twin speaker grills is at the foot of the phone and they have removed the metal screw this time. The display has fairly slim bezels to the left and right and the home and back buttons sit below the screen with the phone's fingerprint scanner found at the rear below the camera. And you still get the headphone jack and the IR blaster at the top. And like previously, the volume rocker and power key is on the side. The display is familiar with a 5.5 inch IPS panel that has accurate colors and crystal clear resolution. This is again a full HD screen with a pixel density of 401 ppi. And as with the Note 4, it's covered with a layer of 2.5D curved glass that makes a huge subconscious difference to your perception of the phone. Running your finger over a smooth surface rather than a raised lip which feels much more natural. And yes, watching videos and playing games is an absolute pleasure on this one too. Under the hood, it houses a Snapdragon 625 clocked at 2GHz, coupled with the Adreno 506 GPU with 3GB of RAM and 32GB of storage. There is also an expandable option with its hybrid SIM tray, and you can also get one with 4GB of RAM and 64GB internal storage as well. For a smartphone that comes under $170, it's quite a capable device. As per my usage, it handles gaming and day-to-day -day tasks without any lags, stutter or overheating. And that performance coupled with the 4100mAh battery is just fantastic. It can comfortably last about a full day when my day-to-day -day uses include a lot of social medias, calls, text, YouTube and a little bit of music and gaming. Since it does not have fast charging support, that huge battery took about 2.5 hours to fully charge. With the increasing popularity of mobile payment services, it's about time that Xiaomi should add NFC to their smartphones. But that is not the case with the Redmi Note 4X. On the positive side, the Global Edition does support all the three UK 4G LTE bands, which is also a plus for UK users if they are aiming to buy a budget Xiaomi phone. Coming to the camera, we have a 13 megapixel Sony IMX258 sensor, which is better than its predecessor. By comparison, the Note 4X takes a decent photo at this price point, with bright, natural colors and good levels of detail. The HDR mode also makes a really big difference, and the standard Xiaomi camera app with various useful shooting modes including manual and beautify and real-time filters is clean and easy to use. And the 5 megapixel selfie camera featuring real time filters are great for occasional selfies. The Xiaomi Redmi Note 4X runs on MIUI 8.1, which is a customized version of Android Marshmallow. It's a fair deviation from the OS, with the app tray removed and the settings menu rearranged. But a search option here quickly helps you find the items you need. The overall interface has a flat, colorful look. Plenty of customization options with a lot of themes and wallpapers and plenty of nifty features such as second space, dual apps and so on. And the RAM management is probably the best still date and thankfully the global edition comes with the Play Store and a few Google apps pre-installed. But at the end of the day, if you want your daily driver to run smooth and lag free, then this is exactly what you get with the Xiaomi Redmi Note 4X. 
In a nutshell, it isn't a huge upgrade over the Redmi Note 4. But if you are planning to get a new budget phone, you should get the Note 4X Global Edition, which is a fine purchase for international users as well. So that's it for this video guys, I hope this video helped you to make an informed decision on the 4X. Since this phone is an import only, you can pick one up from Gearbest, who has always delivered a faultless service. They offer a 3-day dead on arrival warranty, a 45-day money back guarantee, plus a 1-year warranty to cover against all defects. And if you are interested in the next flagship, the Xiaomi Mi 6, do let me know in the comment section below. So subscribe for more awesome content and don't forget to hit that bell icon to keep yourself notified. And as always, thank you for watching and you guys have a great day.